Oh boy, oh boy, you guys missed a lot since uh, since the last episode. Um, I do want to say uh, I apologize for missing a day of uploading. It wasn't because I was being lazy or anything like that. I was just grinding a lot. And I did say I was going to stream the grinding, but ultimately I decided to just do it in my own time. Just because I've been really enjoying streaming shiny hunting. So whenever I streamed, I was like, ah, I'm just going to shiny hunt and I'll just grind in my own time. Uh, but I didn't realize how long the grinding was gonna take me. So just for just for a comparison, when I the last episode we left off, we had like 20 hours of gameplay. Now I've got 65. I have two gym badges. <laughs> Man, I did so much off screen, right? So um, I've got to catch you up on some things. Uh, so first things first, what I did was so I got the Dex Nav last episode, as you guys saw. So I decided I wanted to Dex Nav new Pokemon. Uh, and I also realized because of battling my rival JD in this game, uh, that two cannon gets skill, uh, skill link. I completely forgot two cannon got that. Um, I, I had a, a keen eyes one because we wanted it for the first gym. But you know, after that keen eyes, as far as I'm aware, probably won't be very good. I mean, skill link, keen eyes has got a bit of a gimmick of being good in, in fog, but that's kind of it. If you have defog, you can counter it. So I wanted to get a skill link two cannon. So I was like, okay, fine. I'll Dex Nav a new two cannon. So I've got a new two cannon. Um, I wanted a new ground type because I didn't really want to use a Garchomp in this game because Garchomp's, yeah, I mean, he's my starter, but I don't know. This It's got a bad nature and it's got bad IV, uh, IVs and I, I didn't know you could soft reset for it. So I didn't want to use Garchomp anymore. So I got a new ground type. Uh, I got a new Avalug um, because this thing is calm. And I mean, I can like use the reset berry or the reset, the nature resetter. But like, what if I run into a shiny later on and I want to use the, the nature resetter, like the, the one chance that you can reset natures. I would rather use it on a shiny, for example, you know? Um, so yeah, um, I have a log here, um, got a new one. Uh, I don't really want to use wall rain. I wanted to use a different water type because uh, that's two ice types on my team. So got, got a new water type. And then I got a new Floet um, because Floet is uh, like, this one's good. <laughs> Um, but I just wanted one with better IVs, to be honest. And I got a bold one instead. So um, I've updated that. I'll show you the new team momentarily. But before I do, I also got a bunch of synchronized Ralts. Um, <laughs> this is this is stuff I did off screen, by the way. So we've got Modest, we've got Relax, we've got Bold, we've got Impish, we've got Careful, we've got Naive, Calm, Brave, Jolly, Timid, Adamant. Most of the natures I will want, to be honest. There's like one or two missing. So yeah, got got some good natured Ralts to synchronize because there's apparently there's no nature changers in this game. Actually, I think there's like maybe one. I'm pretty sure there's one, but you, it's not as accessible as Radical Red. So we got synchronized Ralts here to help us. Uh, and then as you're seeing here, uh, your boy filled out his Pokedex a little bit. And that's because the Pokedex, uh, if you go back to the beginning town of this game, there is a stat scanner um, that you can you can use but you can get the stat scanner if you catch 100 pokemon so that's what i did um so off screen uh to reiterate i dex naved hunted for five new pokemon which took a while i caught 100 pokemon <laughs> i think i was on like 20 before i started catching them i caught and evolved a bunch of them um and then i also on top of that caught a bunch of different natured ralts and then on top of that i had to train up my new team uh, and I EV trained them a little bit because that's the whole point of getting the stat scanner, right? The, scat, the stat scanner tells you their IVs and their EVs. And the reason I wanted it to be a mobile stat scanner was because I wanted to check my EVs any point. Um, and you can technically EV train already. You know the grind house that I go to that's got the fire, water, grass type trainer? Those guys in there give out specific EVs. Uh, grass and fire give out special, uh, water give out speed, and then there's the dark type trainer that gives out attack. But that's it. There's no HP, there's no defense, uh, and there's no special defense EVs. And I think that's because Skelly said uh, that he wanted to promote, uh, I guess, more offensive teams than, you know, just bulk. Um, so, uh, with that in mind, here's my new team. We decided to keep Skycore and Coco. I really like them, but I wanted a new ground type. Oh yeah, and of course, Avalug. There's only technically new, two new Pokemon. Uh, we've got Robert here, the Diggersby, my boy. Oh, he's got Earthquake already. Yeah, these guys are really high leveled. I, 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 I got a little carried away and I accidentally got two cannon up to level 54. And because of the way level scaling works, I had to get everyone else up to level 50 something. So, uh, yeah, my team might be a little high leveled. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then I've got Skittles here. I really, I've not really used an Araquanid in like an in-game playthrough. So I really wanted to get one of those uh, just, just to try it out. Water bug, he's got water bubble. He's a cool guy. Um, I, like I said earlier, I want to use a lot of like Gen 6 plus Pokemon because you generally don't get to see them in many playthroughs anymore because most people do ROM hacks between one Gen 1 and 5. It's mainly Gen 1 to 3 Pokemon you see. So 
I don't know. I want to show some love to the later gen boys. Hopefully that's everybody caught up now. I'll try and make this episode a little bit longer just because that was a long intro, but I had a lot to catch you up on. Yeah, so the stats kind of right here, um, it shows you the stats. It's really cool. Um, and I didn't fully EV train these guys mainly because you don't, I don't have the macho brace yet. I don't think you get the macho brace until you get surf. Um, and once you have surf, you can EV train easier. But as of right now, I was just raw dog training against Need Arenas to get HP. So that's two EVs per Need Arena I killed, which means I had to kill, I had to kill 126 Need Arenas uh, to get 252 EVs on there. Um, and then I had to battle the dark type user a bunch to get the attack on these guys. Um, and yeah, I was gonna go all the way and fully EV train all these Pokemon, um, but then I accidentally had speed on my two cannon. Um, and I, you don't get EV resetting berries until after the third gym. So that's why I was like, you know what? I just, I don't, I, I don't need to EV train these guys fully right now. I might end up replacing one of them in the future. I'm going to just wait till it's easier. <laughs> I think the fact that I've got good IVs and good natures, um, on these Pokemon should be enough to, to make the gyms a little bit easier. Um, you don't, you don't need to EV train like this or anything like that. I don't think that's what Skelly wants you to do. I just did it because I'm an absolute madman and I enjoy this sort of thing. But it got to the point where I had done so much stuff off camera. I was like, holy crap, I need to stop. Like I, my time literally tripled in this game off camera. So that was a big Pokemon uh, Unbound time skip. I'm getting a phone call, please hold. Fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah, dude. Yo, what's going on, Pokemon Unbound? Pew, 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 pew. Woo! Sorry about him. He's a bit of a crackhead. Okay, well, big intro out the way. Sorry about that. Um, like I said, there was just too much to catch you up on. I didn't want people being like, wait, why the, wait, what's your, what's your team, man? You know, I had to explain everything. Um, so yeah, that's what I did. How was your guys' day? So it is time to, I'm going to go take on someone else. What's her name? Glaish. Glag, glag, glag. I don't remember. This one, Candice. Candice, dick fit in your. <laughs> hey, what's up? Um, I bet you can't tell what I'm thinking. I'll give you an answer anyway. I want a battle with you. I may be cute, but I'm not push over. I'm gonna focus and win this battle. It's kind of strange that she's in here. Why? Like, is she like the first non sino Like, is she the first? No, is she the first? Like, I don't, have, have we seen another gym leader from like the real life Pokemon games here yet? Like, okay, I'll be honest, right? So I was looking up Pokemon Unbound stuff, and I looked up. I saw a beta. I saw. Um, I was watching. Uh, Christian, Christian Faint Attack. He did a video on the game back in 2017, and the first gym leader back then was Lance. And I'm just like, bruh. <laughs> so, you know, I know that in the, there has been older gym leaders, and you know, not original characters in the past have been real gym leaders, have been gym leaders in this game, but I'm not sure. Wait, why are you level 56? Jeez Louise. Uh, but yeah, like I'm not sure. I mean, I, I mean, I, I think this is the first one I've come across. Maybe I've missed some. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna. Oof. I don't know why they bother showing the hail animation. It literally doesn't hurt any of us. Uh, yeah, Mario Judah is pretty good here. I decided to name it Mario Judah. I don't know why. I thought Mario Judah would maybe fit it as a name. Oh, it's got oh, it's got that hail ability. Oh, you bitch. Yeah, Mario Judah has got no spadef, so I should probably swap out someone that does have spadef. Coco, and now she's using double team. Yep. Okay, this game fucking sucks. Why would you put why would you put her in here? Oh yeah, Coco learned Moonblast. I'm so happy. Double team shenanigans means nothing to Coco. Coco just says yo, what's up, and just Moonblasts. Oh, of course you got fucking Barry. Uh, I've landed three Moonblasts in a row, in a row after it's used double team like three times, and it's in the hail with snow evasion. So like, uh, Coco gets a t Coco. Even if you miss the next five dude i don't care you've smashed it you've absolutely smashed it and coco landed on her fifth one i'm so proud of you coco i think the hail ended i can heal though right yeah i can heal and coco landed her last one while she's on one hp dude coco is an absolute queen thank you coco i need to find out how to get a shiny. You, you guys are gonna have to help me out in the comments like where do i get the shiny stone uh where do i ev train better in the future because i was just looking up pokemon like need arena does two uh hp but i couldn't find any pokemon that does two defense that was available, ready ready for me. Like, I think the only one I saw that I could maybe get is Graveler, but I... Oh, this thing's gonna outspeed me, isn't it? Oop. Oh, I'll use Ice Shard, that's fine. But yeah, I really want... I really enjoy EV training, so that's why I was, like, just going for it, man. I was just... I, I need the Macho Brace first, though, before I I, I ever do that again. We've all just died, dude. Diggers be so insane. And the Mamoswine, Swine, it's probably gonna Ice Shard, to be honest. So I'm just gonna Quick Attack. Yeah, baby. Look at that Quick Attack damage. Oh, you Earthquaked. Hmm. I think it would have sped me probably because it's like three levels higher. Skittles comes in. Oh yeah, I, I got the name Skittles because um, I asked some friends for a good nickname for Araquanid and uh, they, they looked up top 
100 tarantula names or something. <laughs> so uh, Skittles is one of them. And I think that's actually a pretty good name for, uh, especially because I had a bag of Skittles in front of me as well. So bruh, let's go. Let's go. Kale, kale, kale. And we have a Glacio on here. I need to learn where the heart scale people are. Uh, I'm just going to Fury attack. Uh-oh. Stinky. That didn't help. The HP didn't help. The HP didn't help. Ooh, we might be in trouble here. This Glaceon's scary. I'll body slam it. Shadow Ball. Ooh, that stinks. Oh, I've got Ice Body, though. And we paralyzed it. I'm faster. Yes. Body slam again. Miss. Shadow Ball. Live. Recover. I'm faster. Dude, getting that paralysis in Glaceon was necessary. I am using an Avalog in this bitch. I am using an Avalog in this bitch. Let's go. You are mighty. You're worthy of a lot of respect. All right, what do I get for this? Listen, listen, you battled really well, so I want you to have this. Bruh, I did not just battle for a fucking ice gem. Listen, listen, come back to me tomorrow. Next time I'll focus even more and won't lose. I did not just beat your ass just to get an ice gem, bruh. Fuck out of here. I think all that really can be done now is to take on the next gym. Um, I could do a little... Oh, wait, many trainers and blizzards say you love to flying type Pokemon themselves in bird resistance to gold take this just to feel like them oh that's pleasant thank you i've not been up here yet hello um my poor pokemon ever since the entrance today oh right wait oh yeah hmm. i had a few tasks that i could do around here so i want to pad out the video a little bit before i take on the gym leader uh we have oh uh, someone stole this and babysitter um okay got a so these are two that I can do here. And the thing is, while I was grinding, I actually saw uh, the little kid in question. So I will go grab them after. But there is an area up here I haven't discovered yet. Frozen forest. This is where the burglar is, right? Oh my god, a frozen forest sounds like so cool to be in though. The poco in here kind of suck. There's only Sneasels, Cub Chews, and Snowbirds. I do have cut though. Oh, what the fuck? Crabominable. I have 10%. Yo, I can go back. What are you doing here? Oh, do I have to wake it up? That's so weird. Ice puzzles. Yay, I love ice puzzles. Oh, hmm. there's an item over here. It's a snowball. <laughs> Found a snowball in an icy place. Hmm, interesting. Oh, hmm, I guess I need rock smash for that. Uh, oop, I can come over here though. Yes, sir. An ice stone. And I, oop, yes, sir. What's this? Oh, oh, I found him. Oh, hey. Huh, who are you and what are you doing back here? This is my quiet spot for training my precious Pokemon. I don't like it when other people come in here and invited. So you come to take my Pokemon away from me, is that it? I won't let you take her from me. So to get his po to get her Pokemon back, I gotta beat the shit out of him. Or, that's crazy. Well, hello Ninetales. Liquidation. Infuse Ray? Bruh. Get the fuck out of here, use some real strats. And he's got a mighty Anna. Just die, buddy. It's it's good, you're good, bro, just die. It's okay. All right, truth be told, this Ninetales doesn't really belong to me. Sort of, uh, borrowed it. Yeah, that's right for training. I was just so lonely that I figured I'd do that lady a favor. I was about to head back when... What was that? Could it be? No, it couldn't. Oh, there was nothing after all. Now as I was... Oh! Crub... Oh my god, I forgot his cry. It's a monster that lives in the forest! Crabominable... The Crabominable Snowman. Run for your lives. <laughs> Oof. Do I have to beat this thing too? Bruh, there ain't no way. He actually looks kind of okay in this form, though. I mean, I don't know. He's still really ugly, though. Oh, shit. He's like a Dynamaxmon. I'm gonna lunge it twice just to drop its attack. Oh, he's bulking up. You cunt. The job for Mario Judah. I kind of want to try and catch it. Wow, that was easy. I'm gonna assume that none of my members wanted to be named after this. I was right in assuming so. Because I failed to get a uh, Sandy Gast because it was like a static encounter only, I, I didn't want to go through the same trouble of failing to get a crabominable. It stores coldness in its pincers and pummels its foes. It can even smash thick walls into bits. The fact you can get a crabominable this late, like, like we're, I'm about to take on the third gym and I'm level 50, dude. This game is nuts. I mean, I should be only level 40 to be honest, but yeah, that monster was terrifying. Must have woken up during the battle earlier. So uh, I guess I've done training this Ninetales now. It's time for me to return her to her owner. Why would I just let him do that? I don't trust him at all. What's up here? Ooh, I don't, this looks like a Reggie. Yeah, this is a Reggie ruin right here now i gotta figure out where the fuck this lady is <laughs> i mean i guess technically i can i'm gonna go rescue that little kid every time i come down here i accidentally jump over the ledge oh i didn't notice that before every time i come down here I accidentally there's a ledge right there and i never notice it so i'm gonna come over here grab this now i'm gonna jump down the ledge and the little kid's like down here yeah hello ah please don't eat me sniff <laughs> you're not a pokemon I thought a Pokemon was going to eat me. I want to go home. I went away from my mean sister, but I really miss her now. Please take me back up to Blizzard City. I'll follow you there. Oh, mean 
me and Willie have this. I mean, we were battling together. That's kind of cool, I guess. He's got Pikachu. Yeah, they could have been lazy and they could have just made it so um you teleport back up to the sister. I mean, arguably, this is kind of like meh because I've already beat all the trainers. So it does feel very pointless. But yeah, they could have just teleported me to the sister and then like, oh, everything's okay. But no, they added they added this little this little thing. God damn it. Where am I going? Oh, wow. Minier lives here. What the hell? So that's what we were missing. All right, I'm sorry, sorry, Willie. I gotta kill this Pikachu, bro. I want this minier. Give it to me now. Yay! It is dust in the atmosphere. The composition of the dust determines the color of its core. That's so cute. He's purple. I just realized I've got Joe on my team now. <laughs> All right, bro. I know my way home from here. I had fun walking you. You're the best. Yay! We did it. All right, now I gotta find, figure out which house is which. Oh. This guy just gave me the verse seeker. Use that device and you'll find trainers looking for a rematch. Ooh, nice. That'll be good for um leveling. <gasps> she got her nine tails back. Yay. It's you again. The burglar stole my baby, came back and returned it to me. I can perform again. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh please take this egg she laid. Oh. You know, oh god, okay. Dude, this game really does shove ice types down your throat. Like there's so many potential ice types to use. Uh, give me this egg. Thank you. Oh. Oh wow, okay. So this is the person that made the PC. Okay. That's cool. Dude, I keep entering the same houses. I, I'm so fucking lost. Where's that fucking babysitter? Oh yeah, before I forget. If you talk to this guy here, he gives you the EV light. You just gotta show him a Pokemon that doesn't fully evolve. You're right. Coco can and seed still evolve, as promised. So Coco's gonna get an EV light for now. And I hatched the old Vulpix real quick because I hate having eggs. He just says return to Blizzard City to receive your reward, bruh. Oh yeah, before I forget. Hi, do you have an Onyx? Wanna trade it for my Electrode? It's great if you wanna battle my mommy. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Thanks for helping me against your mom. Just more Pokemon for my Pokedex. Roly poly. My mom's gonna flip when she sees my new Pokemon. Modest natured, okay. Not bad, not bad. Hey, go on then. You know what, I actually kinda wanna use this. For a little bit. How's my old Electro Donx is doing amazing. Almost made a hole in the ceiling when I let it out. <laughs> I kind of want to try all the in-game trades just because, you know, it's a cool, it's a cool little part of the game. Dude, I for real have no idea where this babysitter is. I'm gonna lose my damn mind. How am I how am I missing? Is it there's no way it's up here? No, there's nothing up here. Bruh. Wait, it was this house the whole time? I thought I'd already been in here. God, I'm gonna have a stroke. Holy shit. Hello. Brother told me all about the journey back here. You're amazing. Wow. I got returned for that. Okay. To be honest, I just like doing the missions. I just like doing the missions. Returns actually good for Diggersby. My Diggersby doesn't yet have a heart but return is better than takedown so i'll take it anywho now that i got that sorted jesus how did i miss that like 17 times it's finally time to take on the third gym the moment you've all been waiting for i know i am over prepared like a motherfucker give me my fresh water oh it's a flying type gym i thought it was an ice type gym flying types um is used to clip their wings ice rock and electricity um getting to allies requires using the fans and the holes in the ground move between the levels of the gym it's not too complicated just make sure you have um, I haven't been before. Good luck. Okay. That is actually sick. Oh my god. I It makes sense. I don't know why I never clicked that it was a flying type gym. I just thought icy place, icy gym. I'm glad I was proven wrong. Well, now I feel less bad about having a Diggersby. Um, cool. And th that makes sense. That makes sense that we have a, we have a roly poly here. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah. Keep going. You're almost there. It's crazy that she gave me at level 30, which is probably the level that they want you to be around this gym. And I'm level 50. Dude, I'm level 50. I'm so over leveled, man. Hopefully it catches up on me. It, it just means I don't have to train for a while. The fans make the gym really confusing. I'm on a battle everyone, so. Haha, <laughs> I've got you now. Dude, I just got Oko. Holy crap. Pedal dance, finally, a good move. Uh, I'll give it a teary look. There's a, yeah, it makes sense. There's so many bird Pokemon in this game. Where, yeah, there's so many like birds just chilling at the start of the game. So like, we're actually gonna get to see them in like, action although we do have an araquanid which isn't very good the, one of the reasons why i kind of wanted araquanid is because i thought this was a ice gym and i was like araquanid will be good for that you'll resist oof i mean it, it wasn't really like the sole decision though like i wasn't like yes i'm gonna beat the ice gym with araquanid you know i didn't catch him just for that you know um but it was you know it was like a, okay cool that's an extra reason to get it diggersby my boy my man this is his moveset's basically complete now actually hell yeah damn we just oko everything where am i going oh well, I made it to the gym leader. I have a revive. Yeah. And then I've got some... Wait, did I buy like hyper potions? I don't remember. Yeah, I didn't. Oops. Well, I mean, I think I'm overprepared. So I think I should be able to beat this fairly easy without much healing items. But we'll see, I guess. Anyways. Hey there, cutie. Have you ever been to this high up of the ground before? When you're up to this height, the battles are amazing. Oh, do you hear that? Sounds like the wind's blowing in my direction. I don't want to bore you with the chit chat. So let's get to it. Okay. Okay. I'm here for it. Blue lady. She's very blue. She's very blue. Okay. She's got Minier. That's cool. Yellow Minier too. Let's go. Uh, yeah. Minier is special or it can be special. So like, oh, you bitch. 
Oh, it's, oh, we're not super effective on it. Oh, no. Surely not. Okay, this is going to be a lot harder than I anticipated. Stealth rocks, round one. Okay. Yeah, this isn't going to do shit for damage. Watch this. This minion is going to swallow this like it's nothing. Jesus Christ. Oh, my Lord. Ah, uh, okay. It's, yeah, it's got special moves as well. I wanted to check. Yeah, it's got special moves. So I don't need Avalog. Definitely don't need Avalog because this minion just, just, just messes us up. But we might be able to break it. Yeah, we broke it. Cool. Shields down. Wait, it's purple again. What the hell? Interesting. I say we're going to Robert. Take the uh, power gem easily. And then I just return. And she's going to full... Bro, now you full restore? Okay, well, hopefully return does a decent chunk because it's still in shields down form. Yeah, okay, did a decent amount. Return again. Acrobatic slang gem. Are you fucking serious? Bruh. She's not playing around. Oh my lord. Okay, she's got a dodge. Dude, this is... Okay, okay. It's very clear that I'm not ready for this. She for real just whooped my ass. God damn. Okay, I let her beat me because I want to go buy healing items. I'm going to need them. Oh, wait. Shockwave, Rock Tomb, Brian, Venoshock, Low Sweep, Pluck, Bulldoze. Ooh. Damn, I can't buy anything more than super potions, bro. I am way too high leveled. That actually sucks. <laughs> All right, change of plans. We're going to leave with Coco and take on Minior that way because it's a special attacking Minior by the looks of it. So we can take that with our specially bulky Coco. And then Dodrio is scary, but I think Avalog can deal with that. Yeah, that's why I wanted like Mons that specialize in physical defense and Mons that specialize in special defense because like we need this shit. So Minior's here. Super effective attacks aren't really going to get us anywhere. So we just kind of got to damage. Oh, Moonblast crit. Nice. Frame one and the, and the special attack drop. Nice. And the stealth roll comes out. Uh, we're going to Moonblast again. Oh, it does have acrobatics. I forgot about that shit. It's not just physical. Fuck. That almost oko It didn't quite though. Okay, the fact that Coco lived that. Uh, I don't know if Coco is going to be any use, so I'm just going to let it go. And this is where she just full restores though. It's so annoying. Wait. Yeah, so she was Gliscor as I go into Robert. Yeah, very not Pog. I suppose I just go Mario Judah. Salsa Tate's on me, you bitch. Avalanche. Toxic sub? Come on now, bro. There's no way she stays in. I'm gonna go back into Robert. Substituted again. Are you are you for reals? Okay, I'm predicting this all wrong. I'm resetting. So we got really lucky with a crit. So I don't know if we're gonna get like we, uh, we got really lucky that first turn. She withdraws Minior this time though, instead of just acrobatics. I guess she only acrobatics when she's in shields down form. Okay, so that's fine. Uh Gliscor comes in. I then I'm gonna go Mario Judah. I'm gonna just stay in against this thing and just beat it. He's gonna sub again. I'm gonna keep breaking a sub. Uh Avalanche. Oh, your earthquakes this time. Okay. Mmm, that's well played. I think I would much prefer this if the AI couldn't heal. I think the fact the AIs can heal, it just makes it really obnoxious. Because like I if, if they can't heal and I can't heal, that's fine with me. But the fact that they can heal and I don't have full restores is kind of fucked up. Like if she only had super potions, that would be fair, but it's really not. I mean, I know I'm not meant to be level 50, but like I, I should have full restores. I really should. So I'm really confused. She's going to go back into it. Yeah, life score. Yeah, man, 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 man. I wish I had aromatherapy on this. I think I, I used to. Here's where I just avalanche a bunch. And as it earthquakes, I go roly poly. Let him take the aftermath damage. Wait, it didn't hit them physically, so it doesn't count. Fuck. Okay. Um, I go skittles as he goes into pincer wait i go robert and wait why pincer what does pincer do here oh it's mega jesus fucking christ dude how and then this dodrio actually just one shots everything on my team like it outspeeds and one shots everything on my team like i i need avalug to be at full health for this okay so i'll switch and then you switch okay i'm gonna liquidation skittles might be better here Yep. All right. Glide score's gone. Dodrio's coming in. Oh, I get the choice. This. Oh, Avalug. You can't one shot me. Jump kick. Damn near one shot me. Dodrio doesn't even die. Jesus fucking Christ. Dude, this weather is so fucked up. I'm gonna need it to miss the jump kick. For real, for real. Bruh. Miss. Aftermath help. I'll go Robert and quick attack. Get the kill? Yes. Dodrio is a massive threat, so that's good. Uh, Pincer's coming in now. Dude, this thing just storm throws me. Maybe Skycore can take it. Um, uh, I drill peck. Body slam. Just Oko's me. It just Oko. Oh, yeah, it's flying. Jesus. Uh, do I just return? It just Oko's me. Dude, what the fuck? How do I win? This is how we win. Same plan as always. She goes, um, <clears throat> fly score. I go Skittles. She went Dodrio this time. What? Why, though? Actually, why, though? Jesus fucking Christ. I literally have nothing to heal with. Sacrifice four of my mons to get Mario Judah healed up. And now I want to see if I can live a hit from this thing. I can. Okay. Avalanche. It's not going to kill though. It does nothing. It does literally nothing. Dude, what the fuck? 
The fact she goes Dotrio right after this is actually not fucking cool. And I guess it doesn't really change much. I can just go into this and it just kills. What the f I guess this Avalog isn't uh, EV trained that well in defense, so it just dies. Bruh. I thought having two Avalogs was the way to win, but it is not. That Mega Pinsir is actually just not fair. Like the, the Dodrio you can handle, but that Mega Pinsir is genuinely just unfair. That is crazy. Like I'm thinking, oh, I can get a Steel type, but then I just die to Stormthrow. What do you, how do you beat Mega Pinsir? You don't. Uh, Rock, Rock Tomb, I have Rock Tomb, I think. Oh, I can buy Rock Tomb. Uh, Mario Judah can learn Rock Tomb. I don't really want to teach it over Body Slam, but like desperate times calls for desperate measures. I guess the speed drop could help. Tigger speed. I just think I don't have the right team for this. I don't know if she's incredibly hard for other people. I think I might just not have the right team for this. Uh, I could easily go train up that Electrode as well, um, which I might do if we still struggle. I might go level up that Electrode and so it can actually be an active member. It's just the fact that I have Super Potions and I have to sacrifice four Pokemon just to fucking heal an Avalog, whereas she has full restores. Like, that's just not fair. Like, I don't give a shit. That's just unfair. All right, Dodrio or... Yeah, Dodrio. I guess because I, I think one of my Pokemon gained a level during the battle, and I think because it gained a level during the battle, it changed her strat up, so now she goes Dodrio instead of Gliscor. So now that she goes... I mean, yeah, what, what do, how did I beat Dodrio? How did I beat it last time? Oh my fucking god. I used Mario Judah, didn't I? This is so fucking annoying. You know, I need Electrode to become an active member of society. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go train Electrode. I can't I can't do this right now. Like I whew. guys, I wanna explain my pain right now. I spent god knows how many hours last like before the next episode getting my team EV trained, Dex and having them, and I'm just too high level to take on the gym. I it didn't occur to me, like I forgot. There's a level 40 limit for traded Pokemon, meaning we're not really meant to take on this gym in our 50s. We're meant to take it on in our 40s. Um, that being said, I did level up because it was listening to me sometimes. So I think this gym is just going to be a big fucking RNG fest. <sighs> to be honest, I might I might just have to keep throwing myself at it till I win. It's just the fact that she's got full, full restores. She's higher leveled than me. And she has um, the we like her, her her flying weakness is just non-existent essentially. So what the fuck do I do? How do I win? Like worst case scenario, I'm gonna need to make another team, and I don't want to make another team. Um, but I have to make another lower level team. Worst case scenario, I, I guess I guess I could maybe get a different electric type that could be handy. Like electrode might just you know the traded electrode might not be it. I might have to get a luxray. I need like an intimidate. Yeah, an intimidate luxray for um. Yeah, an intimidate luxury for. Ooh, that actually might be the way. Oh, I don't want to have to fucking dex nav mid video though. But I will if I have to. Uh, Dodrio comes out. Yeah, I think intimidate luxury might be the way to go. If this electrode is just too much of an annoyance, it'll be faster to get an intimidate luxury. So we go roly poly. Dodrio comes in. Ah, uh, it's probably faster than me, and it'll probably oko me. No, I'm faster than it. And it roly poly. Listen, let's go roly poly. Let's go. It's not gonna oko or nothing like that, but it will hopefully paralyze. No, we're faster though. And we have Aftermath recoil, so even if it Oko's me, ooh, which it didn't, um, we do have Aftermath. So if even if, you know what, even if you don't listen to me here, bro, oh, you're going to go fly score now, aren't you? <sighs> well, that's fucking annoying. We're going to do this again. Roly Poly is going to come through and discharge. Yes. And now that we know, oh, wait, we die on the next rocks. That's unlucky. I think I just got a light screen and let Roly Poly, uh, I don't know. Actually, wait, no, wait, he went into Pinsir instead. Wait, why? What the hell? Am I faster? I'm faster, dude. Roly Poly is out here doing the most. Uh, discharge. Please just kill me. Yep. Aftermath damage. We go lug, rock tomb, live the storm throw, rock tomb, drop that speed. Now that you don't have as much speed. Oh, she's gonna full restore. I need to, okay. <sighs> okay, I go Dodrio. She was Dodrio, I go Diggersby. Ah, oh, I just gotta let her Brave Bird. Sky core, she jump kicks. Fuck, bruh, I'm in pain. Is she banded? Is that banded Dodrio? It might be, that might be why it's tearing me apart. I'm gonna quick attack it. We don't quite kill, fuck. We got something cooking though. We just need Roly Poly to obey. And it began to nap. Okay. Roly Poly didn't obey. Thanks for Roly Poly. Yes, thank you. Discharge doesn't even do half. Holy shit. And it just straight up kills us. Oh wait, that's actually fine. So she's gonna withdraw. She goes Pinsir. I go Robert. This isn't actually Pog at all. Oh, uh, I guess I can try and... I mean, no, I don't live a hit at all, do I? Storm throw. Yeah. Bro, she got a Crobat as well. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. And it's a special Crobat, dude. I can't fucking win! I'm like tempted to like see if i can gen my pokemon down like they're just too high leveled like that's the issue here my pokemon are just way too high leveled and i don't want to play through this game struggling because my mons are too high leveled oh by the way her crewbat has a fucking z crystal as well so she's got a mega and a z crystal and i ain't got shit holy fuck this is just so stacked against me look at this 
this is supersonic sky strike bro i <laughs> it's just so stacked against me I, I it's just so stacked against you i need a special wall like i literally need a special wall i can i i i have a log just i <laughs> Oh, or I can crit the Crobat with a return. That works too. Pinsir comes back in. Mario Judah. Yeah, yeah, I can't do anything here. Oh, I live. Nice. Recovering my way back up to full health. Let's go. Rock Tomb, drop the speed. Do I outspeed it now? I don't. Unlucky, but we live. I'm going to Avalanche this time, or should I Rock Tomb again? Oh, I'll, I'll Rock Tomb again. Yes. Speed dropped again. Rock Tomb again. Yes. Okay. Robert, kill. She heals, of course. I get another one off. She's healing again. Robert, let's go. Oh, it lived on fucking one HP. Are you kidding me? A return. I don't care. Die. Minior comes back in. Coco can handle that. Gliscor comes back. Okay, Gliscor's in. I Skittles can handle that. If it's not... Okay, I, I, go, I go Robert. Sack Robert. It subs. Fuck. Okay, here's liquidation spam. Oh, God. It's got protect as well. Oh, God. This isn't... This isn't Pog. We've, I think we're lost. This is like the furthest I ever got. Acrobatics. Yep. Fuck me, dude. Holy fucking shit. I only got that far because I crit a Crobat. So the difference is, right, this is going to swap. I Moonblast the Dodrio. Does a nice half. I swap into Roly Coley. Let it die, I guess, or it doesn't die sometimes. That's fine. Yeah, so the, the plan was to let Aftermath kill Dodrio. But I guess this maybe works too. Discharge. I light screen if I can. Uh, yep, yep. Uh, this thing's annoying. Roly Coley dies. Aftermath. Oh, it's so close to dying. Pinsir. It's literally just a roll if it dies or not. So then you go pincer after. I go, I go wait, it, if, I, if I go into Avalog, it goes... This is so fucking unfair, man. Literally just so unfair. All right, Robert, I'm going to need you to get a big crit, bro. Sad that. Okay, I'm 1v1ing this Gliscor right now. Gliscor's dead. Dodrio wants to come back in. I can just let it kill me, right? Yeah, I can just let it kill me. Or I can let it kill Sky... Skycore might... Who's more valuable right now? Skycore or Skittles? I don't think either of them are really valuable. Just kill me. So now it just depends. I'm gonna go Mario Judah. You go Crobat. Fuck this. Bruh. For real, can't have shit in this place. I'm playing this without healing in mind. I do have a revive that I can use. So I need to remember that. All right, Dodrio's dead. So if I go Skycore, they typically like to go Gliscore. I go Skittles. I Void Toxic or something. And then I Liquidation a bunch until uh, it eventually gives up and dies. Uh, Here, it's dead. Cool. Uh, Minier comes back in. Minier? I'm in a good situation right now. Coco? Coco come on if you want a Minier. So then you would want to go Crobat from there, right? Surely. Yep. And then I... I want to Beak Blast it. Nasty plot shit. Although, I think Robert can outspeed and kill. Nope. Oh, fuck. Oh, damn it. Why did I think I could outspeed a Crobat? Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, I think we just lose because nothing, nothing here is taking a hit from a Crobat. I'm bringing out the fucking berries, bro. I don't even care anymore. So the plan is, get Gliscor to toxic me. That's fine. I've got a Petra Berry, bitch. And then I liquidation. The only way I beat this Gliscor 1v1 is if I'm not poisoned. Uh, so, yeah. that's. And he's wasting his full resource, so Pog. Minior wants to come back in. Coco. And then Crobat's going to want to come in. So I go Gl uh, Skycore. And then I think I... I don't know what's going to do more. Beak Blast definitely does the most. Yeah. There's like... It's like inevitable that it's going to get... Oh, that's where... That's, that's, that's what I'm stuck in, dude. I can't Oko the fucking Crobat. Because this game's dumb and took away super effective moves. Oh, okay. I literally just lose here. I can't... I, I, how do I beat this fucking Crobat? Oh, my God. I've got two Pokemon left. I killed the Pinsir. With the uh, Rock Tomb shenanigans with Mario Judah. There's Minior and Crobat left. I don't see how I win. <sighs> Wait, no. Coco comes in. I Moonblast. Yep. Can I live? No. Can I live in Acrobatics? Probably not, huh? Just gotta return it. Doesn't matter. It's faster than me. Dude! Come on, man! I think this is genuinely the hardest battle I've ever had to do in any Pokemon game ever. And it's... I think it's just... I think, like I said, it's literally just because I'm, like, too high leveled. So, I, I could be wrong. But I feel like it is. Maybe not. Because I can't use him. I don't know. It's just so fucking stupid. And yeah, I can tone the difficulty down if I want to. Like, you don't have to play on this difficulty. But I'm not going to back down. I ain't a bitch. It doesn't help that the AI also randomly decides to heal and then randomly doesn't. Like, if right there, that battle I was just doing, if it didn't heal, I could have then quick attacked the pincer and killed it. But of course, you know, I was like, oh, it's going to heal. So I'm going to return. And then she just didn't heal. So... Fuck me, dude. Paralyze the Crobat. Okay, thank God. We've got the fucking... We've got the run we need. You know what? Discharge all you want, bro. This thing's gonna storm throw me. Coco takes it. Do I then go Mario Judah from there? I think so. Nope, never mind. This pincer is obsessed with me. I can't even beat it now because it's... Yeah, I just... I don't... Mean it. I'm like sitting here debating like, do I go out and train an Agron? Agron would be good for Crobat, right? But it'd probably still fucking nuke me with its Z-move. So, I... I... 
I, I just, I, I've made a list. The gym leader has full restores, mega evolution, Z moves, a wind that makes super effective moves on flying types neutral, higher levels than me, and I have super potions. This is fucking dumb. I know it's expert mode. I know. And I can play on a lower difficulty. I can. I, I just, I'm just amazed that like, this is ridiculous. Oh yeah, the AI also has hazards. That's right. What happens by playing set mode? Like surely that's got to do something, right? I don't think it's set mode really helps me at all anyway, so... Please don't go glide score. Please don't go glide score. Fuck you. I'm going to give set mode a whirl. There's just so many things I've got to keep in mind. Like here, i got to remember to recover instead of fucking uh, uh, rock tombing right away. Otherwise, I'm going to die. So then I, now I can rock tomb. And then we got a third one off. Go Robert. I'm a swords dance. And then I return. It doesn't quite oko. Okay. Fuck me. I want to die, dude. If every gym's like this, then I might actually lower the difficulty because I just cannot be fucked. I don't have time to like just play this game on hours on end, you know? If the flying type wind wasn't there, it would actually be so fucking doable. Like so many things just have to go in my favor, right? I got to get the Dodrio below half health. Otherwise, um... The electrode won't die. So I just gotta reset now because it's not below half health. That should be enough, right? Electrode doesn't quite die. So then they switch. Dude, it's just fucking annoying. Like, watch. Okay. So it okos me. Aftermath plus the Brave Word recoil just isn't enough to oko it. So then, whatever I go into, I mean, I guess I could go Robert. Do I get a free Swords Dance here? I do. Ooh, we might be okay. Oh, wait. No, he's faster than me. Because I didn't fucking rock to him. I for real want to die. I feel like the AI cheats. If I send in any other Mon, he'll stand in and attack me. But because he knows I have quick attack, he switches. Look at this shit. So dumb. So basically, if this thing lives against Roly Poly, which it didn't. Okay, thank God. Now I go Skycore. Glyscore comes in. Skittles comes in. Toxic, Petra Berry. I liquidation and just kill it to death. Uh, and then after that, we'll see what happens. This is finally a decent run. Now it's going to it's gonna full restore. Yep. Just die, dude. For real, just die. Minior comes back in. Okay. See, this is where the, the, the shift mode actually helped me. Is it let me go Coco? Um, but I don't think I uh, particularly need... Huh. I don't think I particularly need skills anymore. So I think I just sack skills. Now I can go Coco. Now I can Moonblast. Acrobatics does fucking so much damage. It's gonna kill me. I, I don't even know what to do about this Minier. I, I, I actually don't think I can beat Minier either. Dude, there's it's just, there's always something. I beat Blast. Acrobatics burn. Does that help? I don't have no idea. Swords Dance. Fuck me. It doesn't. It doesn't help. I think I need to get an Agron. I genuinely think I need to go out of my way and get an Agron. The thing is though, once I get Agron, the, the entire battle is going to change and I have to relearn that. But I don't think this battle is winnable for me, like right now at all. I don't. I just don't think so. Robert kills. Dodrio. Robert kills. There's many are left. Oh, Deep Blast. I think I got a... I don't think I... This shit sucks, dude. I just can't get past this little shit either. Bruh! Can I... Can I... I can't live a hit. Yep. I was, that was the closest I think I've ever got to winning. Dude, this pincer's too much. Because I need... Okay, so the th situation is I need Skittles for Gliscor. I need Mario, Judah, and Robert for this fucking pincer. And I need Coco for Minier. So if I switch here, someone's taking a body slam. And Mario, Judah doesn't live that. So then Mario, Judah just dies. So the thing is, I don't think Coco even beats Minier. So... And I got fully paralyzed. Swag. Yeah, I can't... This run's dead. I can't... I literally... And I just lose to this mini right here because it just acrobatics me to death. I, I can't win, bro. Okay, I've got a different idea. Skills is the lead. I liquidation. They always want to stealth rock. That's fine. She full restores. And because of the way the form works, I can Oko it next turn. So mini is now out of the way. Dodrio comes in. Um, I sack Coco. I go roly poly. Uh, I discharge. I uh, ignore orders and light screen. That's fine too. Got some free damage on Crobat. Nice. I can now just return you and die. Dodrio comes back in. This thing's definitely banded. Um, Skycore can die. Robert comes in. It doesn't want. He'll want to switch. Yep. Return the pincer. Oh, this is a tough situation. Um, I'll quick attack. Fuck it. Rock tomb. Recover. And then I rock tomb again and it dies. Yes. Mario Judah can we want we want it. Dodrio comes in. Shit. I didn't think about this. Any quick attack. Um, wait, no, it won't kill. Yes. All that's left is Glyscore. Oh. This might be the one. This is the run. This is the run. This is the run. Fuck you. This is the run. This is the run. All I had to do was change leads. I was like, wait, why am I leading Coco? What does Coco really do for me? Fuck out of here, boy! Fuck you, dude! As soon as I swapped up the, 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 the lead, we got him. That was still fucking stupid, but I'm so glad I beat out an expert with it. With, because I didn't want to... Go out and get a, an Agron and relearn the battle because she'll play differently now that I've got an Agron. Fuck it. That's proof of your victory against the Blizzard City Gym Leader. Take the Wings badge. Dude, I really hope that um they catch up to me. I, I, like I said, I'm way too high leveled. Like, she's going to put the, the level cap up to 50, right? Yeah. And so my Electrode still doesn't obey me. Dude, this is nuts. This is actually nuts. Oh my God. I need like a B team or something. 
I might need a B team just to, oh, I don't know. I'll figure it out for next episode. But I wanted to do a little bit more than just take on the gym. But this has been a mess. So uh, thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to wrap it up here. I can't believe I finally got the gym badge, dude. <sighs> I thought I was gonna have to. I forgot to show you something. Please come with me to the KBT Expressway. Uh, for some reason, the entrance KBT is frozen over. As you know, to say, it's my job to take care of it. Uh, all right, Chuck. All right. What's his name? Not Chuck. The Driftvale Stadium leader. Uh, just face. Um, just face a crack with the rock smash. You'll be able to break it by pressing A. And if you have all HM turned on, uh, rock smash, you won't even be asked if you want to break it first. I'll be understand. Basically, you can rock smash now. Yep, yep, yep. Thank you. Thank you, dude. Yeah, sorry if I sounded really whiny this video. I mean, I, I still love the game and I don't think it's, I mean, I'm playing on expert difficulty. Of course it's gonna be stupid, right? Um, of course, but just look at what, what my team was reduced to. <laughs> yeah, I mean, of course it's gonna be expert, right? I, of course it's gonna be ridiculously hard on expert. Of course, I cannot imagine how insane it is. Um, I definitely didn't have the best team for that gym. Um, that didn't help. And I'm definitely too high leveled to where super potions don't help. Um, but we won regardless. I'm a firm believer of you can win any battle as long as you get things to go the right way. So it was like, it was like solving a Rubik's cube. I just had to figure out all the, the correct orders of doing things. And once I did, we got it. So yeah, that's that. I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching. As always, drop a like if you enjoyed. I'm going to try and keep this a daily series, but I have to keep doing grinding. I don't know how long I can do daily. Jesus Christ. Hopefully that was the last bit of grinding I had to do for a while because that was that grinding took me so long. But I mean, to be fair, most of it was catching Ralts and filling my Pokedex and Dex Naving. And I won't have to Dex Nav five Pokemon all at once. Unless I get a B team. I'm thinking about it. Anyways, bye bye, guys.